Just when you thought it was safe to go back to Microtech, the Intergalactic Aerospace Expo is back for 2951. Welcome to Whitley's Guide. That frosty air can only mean we're back in your favourite winter wonderland, Microtech. We're currently gearing up to head to the Tobin Expo Centre in cooler than cool new Babbage and seizing the opportunity to put this Anvil Spartan through its proverbial paces. The team designed this not-so-little beauty specifically to transport the most precious cargo of all, your friends, family, favourite heavily armed mercenary outfit, etc. So if you're looking to get a load of folks from point A to point B and keep them all in one piece, then the Spartan was seemingly designed just for you. But this is Whitley's guide, so we aren't just going to take Anvil's word for it. Plus, hey Marty, how are you? I needed some uh, personnel to looking good, Merrill, to transport for this segment, and there's nothing my good to see you, Terry, executives here like more than not paying extras. Everybody in, off we go. machine, Anvil uses the Atlas platform that their Ballista anti-aircraft unit is built on, so they obviously aren't taking personnel transport lightly, so to speak. But I want to find out just how heavy this metal really is. And since this rig's low profile keeps us safe from those anti-aircraft turrets, Jimmy here is about to make things a little more interesting. We're about to find out if this Spartan can stay cool under pressure, whilst keeping our friends back there relatively comfortable in the face of impossibly heavy turbulence. sound of silence means we've all survived, thanks to the handling of Anvil's Road Warrior, which is all well and good cos we're here. And with that, we kick off another intergalactic aerospace expo, arriving in true Whitley style. And this year we've got more raw, uncut excitement, more pulse-pounding, heart-pumping, senses-shattering wildness than ever before. I mean, honestly, IAE 2951 what is, is going to make McCleary? more. Is this segment supposed to be a callback to episode 223? Hold on, let, let's, let's cut. All right, we're cutting. Wait, what? Yeah, I've seen this before. BTS, keep rolling. Jimmy, are you in the edit bay? What is she on about? That's a little too close for comfort. How are you, shareholders? I... Shareholding up I don't believe it. I'm not sure what you're going for here, McCleary, but between you and me, the ratings haven't been wrong. Great. Listen, I'm rooting for you, though. Huge fan. Where are you all off to? VIP loud? Oh, hello. Oh, Jax. I don't know, Jimmy. Maybe this gig is passing me by. I mean, clearly I'm out of ideas. I'm rehashing old material without even realising it. Oh, sure, but who wants to see the same old bits? I mean, even in reverse. Maybe you're right, Jim. Or maybe we just need to pull out the big guns. Don't we have something amazing planned for the Aegis bit? 
I just need to clear my head, figure out an angle, and start fresh on the next segment. I'll be in my trailer. <laughs> <laughs>